welcome back so actually in the last episode we defeated the dragon on our Lytra and remember how I was showing you about these and we got custom head things one of the other things I did was get these custom blocks so if I trade with them it gives us miniature blocks basically so for builds this would look amazing but that's not today's episode. I did fix my mods and found why I couldn't use Optifine. There was just like one problem. Just finish up here. I'm trying to get some more villages in here. So today's episode, I'm kind of lacking on resources. So I think I should build a farm. And not just a farm loads of farms so i'm going to build a creeper guardian and a sand duper and concrete duper concrete farm and a stacking rate farm so you might be wondering why build all these farms for what reason well if i open up my browser opera gx on my channel if you go to my channel i'll show you here as it loads if you go onto the channel then to community there's a few different build options and it's mainly what i want to build and i want you guys to pick what size i should build it Here we go. This should show it. Hey. Yes. This over here. So I want to build a massive game. So I'm gonna is three different sizes. This is 16 by 16, 32 by 32, and 64 by 64. They, they each go with each one. Those are the biggest. I worked it out for the biggest one. It's a single chest of lime green concrete. The same for green concrete. Then a double chest and six stacks of sea lanterns. Double chest of Three double chases of iron, four double chases of black concrete, five double chases of prismarine bricks, and five double chases of prismarine, seven double chases of dark oak, and dark prismarine, twelve double chases of angstone. For the biggest one, it is massive. So, I want you guys to pick. And besides that, I think let's get going. I believe if I fly over this way, yeah, we have this ocean. So if we just fly a little bit, let's see. So we can, we'll both raid farm somewhere out in the ocean. Yes. So we've got an ocean monument there. So I might build the raid farm like here. Or actually a bit further out but we're not right now we need to collect some resources so I'm going to collect all the resources get everything organized and I'll build the farms but before I get all the resources for the farms I'm running low chocolate boxes so I decided to end up to the end and I found an end I mean an end city so I'm gonna loot this and loot some more and then we'll go get some more resources. The long end trip and quite a few sugar box crafting. We have 
almost a whole shulker box full. And I got all the materials here. If I just head over to the nether, I am running on rockets. And head this way. These two portals right here. This one is where the guardians are going to die. And just on the other side of that, we have the guardian temple. And there's a portal for me to go to the overall where I'll build creeper farm and some other stuff so right now I think I've got all the blocks here we build rebuild this portal a bit higher with the kill chamber and I'll be right back
Welcome back. It's been quite a while, a few weeks now, but if we just grab rockets, I did actually go and mine more obsidian. I don't know why. I found it in the chest for some obsidian. So, yeah. But, anyways, as you can see, they are. So this was a mission I almost died quite a few times. Uh -huh. ooh, ooh. Because they deal a lot of damage. Yeah. You can see they bounce up. They are quite good swimming, so we noise here. But if we head through to the other side. You need more fire rockets, but yeah. And found out today that, which is the 1st of January, that in six days is the brand new Minecraft update. <laughs> so, any plans that I had, like to get netherite armor, that's just ruined. But yeah, as you can see. All of this is now nicely kept in here. <laughs> Here we go. Yeah. So this much should go. Yeah. So now that we have this beautiful thing. Now that we have this one built, I would like to have another farm there. So I want to make a creeper farm to a creeper and bamboo. Because with the brand new update, bamboo you can craft into wood. So this is perfect. So let me just check. It's not that big. It is quite a bit of glass. Uh, bamboo. Oh, we don't. Add, do we have bamboo? I don't think so. But I'll get the resources for this and for that creeper farm. But how are we going to get all of that? I mean, it's quite a few resources. If only we had a sand and concrete. Let's check the material list. Yeah, this is quite doable. Okay, so I'm gonna gather all the materials for this because we can quickly do this one. You know, just need to build some. Yeah, okay, I'll be right back. After some time, you guys saw the guardian farm over there after it was built and I've got the resources for the new creeper farm and it's like it's just that so I decided why not make this place look a bit better so just temporary water smelter the portal which I will fix at some point we're gonna have this massive creeper farm there's the AFK platform up there. We've got our guardian farm over there. So if I AFK up there, hopefully we'll get ready to a guardian creeper and I might put a bamboo farm here. So everything will run together. Well, I guess let's get building.
So after like four hours of building and a lot of preparations, I will take down that and that. We finally have our beautiful platform spot. And I, I think there's even a creeper. So <coughs> if we just turn turn on these over here then you'll probably be able to see them when I show you yeah go water starts and goes out and then it's all again and it'll continue to sleep so let's just wait a second So we can get out. And this should be working now. If I just make it look all pretty and it's gonna have to make sure that everywhere underneath lets up. Because we do not want any creepers down there. So this 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 farm is made by Sugar Crow. I do recommend go check out their channel. I will put it in the link, and it creates how much is it? Like two thousand three hundred, two thousand three hundred pieces of gunpowder. Then they will get organized into here, and. The AFK platform. If I can get up there, it's right over there. Give myself much of a landing platform. Ah. Let's see. Let me quickly get up there. So. We are finally up here. And if I just use my free cam, I guess I can take that away. Fly down. You'll be able to see creepers being pushed off and going into there. And let, I just want to check something. Okay, so this isn't like rendered in. That's quite nice. Then these chests will start to fill up. So, well, this guy. Oh, this is running. I'm gonna leave you guys. And I need to do some lovely homework and study work. So, I'll be back a bit later.
Hello guys and welcome back. So the little time lapse you guys saw, it was only three hours. It's been about six hours now. So I guess let's go see our profit. My light is on. Dive bomb. Okay. So there's four chests we have to check. Actually, before I do that, let me just put all of that away. Here we go. Okay. Oh. I, I do think we're not going to need gunpowder for a little while. Not as much as I thought they would be for how long I AFK for, but I mean. Not the biggest farm in the world. Alright, so what are we gonna do with this gunpowder? So I think let's build a, actually two farms. I was just building. I'm gonna build a bamboo farm and a sugarcane farm. So I think the sugarcane farm, three, depending on how you build, because if you build it, in like a wall, I think let's build it right here. And like, lock it in. I'm gonna do some research, find one, and let's build. Okay, so after quite a while, I decided I'll just do the bamboo farm. I've got that smallish wheat farm at home, which is working fine. And there's the schematic, just ignore the sandstone. Fortunately, I built it in the ground. So, didn't really go anywhere. And this is filling up quite quickly. Just quickly switch that off. Yeah, I built a rail <laughs> Oh, that's a little ridiculous. Okay, so here's everything we need. And a little bit of bamboo to just get it started. So I guess let's build it. Then. I'm gonna build it, add some things on, and I'll be right back. Hello guys and welcome back. So I finally built it and it is big. So it uses a flying machine and I just added some decoration. And my quad hoppers. So the flying machine will fly, break the bamboo, which will be fall onto the block. And the mine quad hoppers will come pick it up and drop it back in and go out. Unfortunately, there's a few holes here which I could fix, but don't really need to. And then Stop that so it won't go. All of it gets stored there and it'll just be organized into these chests over here. And I guess there's that new update coming out. And I'm currently waiting for the mods to update before I go into it, but once that update comes out, we'll have almost everything we need and I lost my sword at some point so I had to go and make a new one and I managed to get quite good with fire aspects, sweeping, knockback, sharpness five me, I'm breaking, looting three and mending. So that is really good now. And I think we should at some point is a way that you can basically break minecraft or a certain snapshot where you can put every type of protection onto a piece of armor it's like 1.14 points something snapshot so that would be quite fun to do but anyways i think between the episodes i'll just Finish this road, finish the lamps, make
make this look nicer. Might even just put a wall or two here to encase it. So I'll see. But yeah, I think that's it. So just a recap here. Yeah. We built a guardian farm, which also works as a squid farm temporarily, a creeper farm, and a bamboo farm. Doesn't sound impressive, but it took a lot of time. And then, actually, let's check on the guardian farm. Here we go. So I have been crafting stuff in there. But just to show you, this is just a little bit of AFK. And these are like completely full. Oh. So yeah. Thank you guys for watching, and I'll see you in the next video. Bye-bye now.